Hello guys, welcome back to another new video. So in this video, I will be showing you how you can install TWRP recovery on your Huawei MediaPad T5 device. So in my previous video, I have already showed how you can unlock the bootloader of this device. If you didn't unlock your bootloader, please check my previous video and also you will get necessary driver there. So you can download the driver and install the driver. Otherwise, you cannot even install the TWRP and also the link of the recovery image will be in the description below you can find it there and download it so let's jump into the tutorial so first of all you have to turn off your device power off after powering off just connect your device with your computer pc or laptop whatever you are using so connect it Press the volume down button and power button together, it will boot into fast boot mode. So I have made a mistake I think. So just press the volume button and the power down button to boot into fast boot mode. As you can see, it's booting into the fast boot mode. So the phone is unlocked and FRP unlocked. So if you didn't unlock your device it will show uh, the phone is locked so you can't install TWRP so after that um, go to your PC and as you can see I have downloaded the TWRP recovery and the name of the TWRP will be TWRP3 dot something else so I just changed and renamed it for my convenience after that you just go to your drive drive c and program file then find the minimal adv driver and first boot so you have to install the driver if you install the driver you have this uh, folder the, here you have to paste the recovery file so if if i recover if i paste it here as you can see they are saying it's already there so i no need to do it again so just um write cmd here cmd after the type recovery uh, uh, first boot devices so first of all type first boot devices as you can see here the serial number is showing so that means my phone is connected with my laptop so if your phone is not connected with your laptop it will not show any kind of serial key here so that time you have to check either your cable is the problem or you don't have the driver so check it properly after that you have to write first boot Slash recovery then dash RAM disk after that you have to write your recovery name so my one is recovery.img .img then press enter as you can see it's said finished that means your recovery is written in your device then unplug your device from the PC Please don't close TW. Uh, don't don't close your first boot right now. Just unplug first. Then press the volume up button and the power button together. Give it some time to boot. Then when it's vibrate, just leave the power button and. As you can see the device is booting now so it will directly boot into your um, TWRP if it's flushed properly otherwise it will not so let's see so as you can see it's showing the team team win recovery project 3.6.9.0 so as you can see I have already installed the TWRP in my tablet so hopefully it will be helpful for you and in my next video I will be showing you the proper custom ROM for this device There's, there is some one custom ROM which is working properly in this device so in my next video I will be showing that how you can install that ROM so that is it for today see you next time thank you very much for watching